kindly subscribe to our youtube channel to watch the full lecture hello everyone welcome to my youtube channel in today's video let us see how to prepare a cost sheet the question is on the screen kindly take the screenshot of the question prepare a cost statement stock on 1st january 2021 that is raw materials it is 30500 and stock 1st january 2021 finished goods it is 20400 stock 31st january 2021 raw materials it is 48500 stock 31st january 2021 finished goods it is 10000 and purchase of raw materials is 25000 work in progress as on 1st january 2021 it is 8000 work in progress as on 31st january 2021 is 9000 Sales is ninety five thousand. Direct wages is twenty thousand four hundred. Factory wages is ten thousand five hundred. On uh, and office expenses related to production is five thousand four hundred. Selling expenses is thirty. Sorry, three thousand eight hundred. Distribution expenses is two thousand five hundred. Also calculate the percentage of work expenses to direct wages and the percent percent of office expenses to work cost. So this is our question. Let us see how to solve this problem. Now this is the format statement of costs for the month ended thirty first January two thousand twenty one. They have given the opening stock of raw materials. So first we need to consider opening stock of raw materials. What is the opening stock of raw materials? It is thirty thousand five hundred. For this, you need to add the purchases. So, purchases of raw materials. So, purchase of raw materials is twenty five thousand. Next, from this, we need to. Subtract minus the closing stock of raw materials. Closing stock of raw materials. What is the closing stock of raw materials? The closing stock of raw materials is forty-eight thousand five hundred. Forty-eight thousand five hundred. Now add thirty thousand five hundred plus twenty five thousand minus forty eight thousand five hundred. We will get seven thousand. What is this seven thousand? Seven thousand is raw materials consumed. Raw materials consumed. Now for this we need to add the direct wages. So we need to add direct wages. How much is the direct wages? It is twenty thousand four hundred. Now add this seven thousand and twenty thousand four hundred. We will get twenty seven thousand four hundred. That twenty seven thousand four hundred is nothing but our prime cost. Now for this we need to add the factory overheads. In question, only one O factory overhead is there. That is factory wages. That factory wages you need to add here. How much is the factory wages? It is ten thousand five hundred. Now add twenty seven thousand four hundred plus ten thousand five hundred. You will get thirty seven thousand nine hundred. What is this thirty seven thousand nine hundred? It is our work cost. Now our next procedure is we need to add opening work in progress and subtract closing work in progress. First, we need to always add opening work in progress. How much is opening work in progress? It is eight thousand. 
Now add this 8000 for 37900. You will get 45900. Now for this 45900, we need to subtract closing work in progress. Closing work in progress. What is the closing work in progress? Closing work in progress is 9000. So subtract 9000 from 45900. We will get 36900. Now for this we need to add administration and office overhead. So what are all the office overhead we have? Only we have office expenses. How much is the office expenses? Office expenses is five thousand four hundred. Now add this five thousand four hundred for thirty six thousand nine hundred. We will get forty two thousand three hundred. This is nothing but our cost of production. Cost of production. Now next procedure is what we need to add the opening finished goods and subtract closing finished goods. We need to add opening finished goods and subtract closing finished goods. Opening finished goods is how much? Opening finished goods is twenty thousand four hundred. Then closing finished goods is ten thousand. This ten thousand we need to subtract. For forty two thousand three hundred we need to add twenty thousand four hundred. Then we need to subtract ten thousand. We will get fifty two thousand seven hundred. What is this fifty two thousand seven hundred? It is Cost of goods sold. Cost of goods sold. For this, we need to add selling and distribution overhead. Selling and distribution overhead. How much is selling and distribution overhead? Selling expenses is selling expenses plus distribution expenses. Selling is three thousand eight hundred, and distribution is two thousand five hundred. Both, if you add, we will get six thousand three hundred. Now add fifty two thousand seven hundred plus six thousand three hundred. We will get fifty nine thousand. What is this fifty nine thousand? It is nothing but our cost of sales. Now we know that the cost of sales is fifty nine. Thousand in question they have given the sales so leave one line and write here sales sales is how much ninety five thousand we know cost of sales and we know sales so it will be easy for us to find out profit so what is the formula to find out profit the formula is sales minus cost of sales means ninety five thousand minus fifty nine thousand. When you minus ninety five thousand from fifty nine thousand, we will get thirty six thousand. This is one part of question is over. Now we need to calculate the percentage of work expenses to direct wages and percentage of office expenses to work cost. Now we need to calculate overhead rates. So calculation of overhead rates. First one, what we need to calculate? We need to calculate percentage of work expenses, percentage of work expenses to direct wages, direct wages. Now, the formula is work expenses divided by Direct wages into hundred. So, how much is the work expenses? Here you can see the work expenses is 
टेन थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड सो टेन थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड डिवाइडेड बाय हाउ मच इज द डायरेक्ट वेजेस डायरेक्ट वेजेस इज ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड इंटू हंड्रेड वेन यू डिवाइड दिस यू विल गेट फिफ्टी वन पॉइंट फोर सेवन परसेंटेज सो नेक्स्ट इज परसेंटेज ऑफ परसेंटेज ऑफ ऑफिस एक्सपेंसेस टू वर्क कॉस्ट टू वर्क कॉस्ट द फॉर्मूला इज ऑफिस एक्सपेंसेस द फॉर्मूला इज ऑफिस एक्सपेंसेस डिवाइडेड बाय वर्क कॉस्ट इंटू हंड्रेड सो द ऑफिस एक्सपेंसेस इज हाउ मच ऑफिस एक्सपेंसेस इज फाइव थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड then work cost work cost is how much it is 36900 so into 100 when you do this you will get 14.63 percentage hope you have understood this problem very well the notes for this i have put in the first comment kindly download the notes and study well thank you if you have any queries regarding today's session kindly send your queries to education.mbbroadcast@gmail.com